Hi everybody, it's Tasha. Okay, yay for 2011. Unfortunately, of course, as we all know, the only thing predictable about life is its unpredictability. Okay, still going with the prerequisite classes. Haven't started them yet. We'll be starting them on January 18th at 9 a.m. and they end at 10... 10.05, I believe? Anyway, they're about an hour long. Still going with those. Unfortunately, I am not going to be taking a certification program through Kingway College like I had originally planned. However, I am going to be going to Job Corps right after I'm done with my prerequisite classes. My plan is to, okay, first off, I'm going to hopefully be receiving my FASBA, my financial aid and everything like that, and the school has approved me for $5,366. My tuition for these two classes is only $756. So I will actually have a lot left over. Whatever I have left over, I'm putting into a savings account. And hopefully I will be getting a job soon. I've applied everywhere right now and been calling them like crazy. I'm like practically harassing them. So let's hope I'll be getting a job soon. And as I work, I'll be saving up money as well as going to school. So right after that is done and I have money saved up and I've calculated. And if I do this correctly, I should have between $7,000 to $9,000 saved up by the time May. That's if I get my FASBA. If I don't get my FASBA, then I might have maybe three to four thousand saved up at the most. So after I get that, after I save money, I'm going to be moving back to Georgetown. Hopefully, be staying with someone that will let me stay with them, either my mom or maybe with some friends of mine, Nikki and Ricky. You know, maybe they would let me stay with them. I don't know, or maybe. I can just like use a thousand and stay in a hotel for a while, who knows. I don't know how it's going to go, but hopefully I'll have a place to stay, apply for Job Corps, you know, get all the registration crap out of the way, go to Job Corps, stay there, get certified through pharmacy technology like I originally planned, you know, to get certified as a pharmacy technician, so I can do that through them as well. Might actually be a lot less time. and take driver's ed since I still don't know how to drive. I know that seems weird and I know that's terrible, but I don't. It's unfortunate. I just never learned, never paid attention. So do that. Get out. Get my life together. That's the plan. Another part of the plan, my boyfriend might go into Job Corps with me since his only other option right now is the military and his job hunt's not going that well at the moment. So. Me and him both could be going in and getting certified and getting our pharmacy technician license or certification. Getting out, being able to get into good career fields, you know, making 12 to 15 an hour depending on where we're at. And hopefully get our lives together and be able to be financially stable. And with the money I save up, you know, right when we get out, get an apartment, pay all the deposits, get some food, you know. We might not have the best situation, but you know, after we get a careers and we're starting to get the checks rolling in again, then everything will be right on foot and everything will be good. So that's my plan and I'm really hoping this works and I'm really hoping my FASBA pays off. Because without that FASBA, it's going to be rough. So fingers crossed people, let's hope this plan for 2011 works because this is going to be an all year plan. If not, probably into the year 2012 too. So, like I said, fingers crossed. Let's keep these fingers crossed and let's hope to God that everything works out. In May, we will know for sure. So, I'll keep everyone updated. I love you, Nikki. I love you, Ricky. I love Morgan. I love Anthony. I love Bill. I love Cass. I love Amanda. And I love Derek and Joyce. Y'all are all. Oh, and did I say Amanda? I don't know. I love you, Amanda. I love all y'all. Y'all are great friends. I'm so happy that y'all have been here supporting me. I know today's been a really bad day for me as far as just grr. I blame hormones. Girls, you know what I'm talking about, but <laughs> I blame hormones. So I'm going to thank especially Cass right now since she's been talking to me all day and she's been keeping me good company and helping me be stressed. So I love all of y'all. Have a happy 2011. I know I didn't make a New Year's video, but this is it. <laughs> a little late, but... 
Let's all have a happy year this year.